Hello, welcome in Gavis Dams. I've changed the location once again. Tonight, I'm back in inside the, the, the house. I'm no outside the conservatory where you can hear noises. So anyway, I'm looking forward to this. Bring back 12 cast strength. As you can see, all these are opened. That's the only one I've not opened. I knew we never opened was going to do this tonight. Uh, what like a live auction? And there's a few of these on the live auction at the moment. And you'll not believe it, no, you will believe it. £180. And there's still a week to go in the auction. Crazy. Absolutely crazy. What makes me angry is people want to drink these. People like myself, and we can't get them. I've gone to the shop and I just say, I want a spring bike 12, I want a spring bike 15, and I get it. But lately, it's not been like that. Well, you have to put your name down for the gallon. We have to try and get there. And I think it's it's nonsense, but it's the way it is. So anyway, I'm going to open it. Spring Bank 12, September 21, it's the latest one. So here we go. £100. Been a pub. But it's not really. Because I enjoy drinking these. And I don't understand anybody. But we do. They're in it for the money. Let's be honest, they're collectors and they're in it for money, but it's people want to drink it. People like myself want to drink spring banks and we can't get drink them because of this. And spring bank, I, 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 I keep, keep it down, they, put, they don't put a lot out, they just keep it a nice quantity and it keeps, it keeps the quality. But here we are, 2002. And people are prepared to pay £180. I've got, I've got it £200. I know it's last week on the auction. One of these was going for a thousand pounds. A thousand pounds! Mad! It's pop. Listen to that gargle. Nice sweet drum. That'll do nicely. And as far as I'm aware, Smell that already. As far as I'm aware, this is bourbon. This is 100% bourbon. This one. And it's 55.9. So it's fairly strong. Looks nice. Hold it up. Don't put the legs on it. And they're climbing to the glass very, very nicely. They're hardly moving at all. Take time. So. We'll give it a wee noise without shaking it. And you know, 59 point, 55.9, there's no any nose prick on it. That's unbelievable. Not a bit. You can get your nose right into that. It's floral. No lot, it's not giving away much at the moment. It might have to sit for a while, but certainly not giving away much. Slightly peated. I know what I'm looking for. Now there's something coming off it now. Fudge. White chocolate. Cream. That kind of taste. It's starting to open up. It's no fair. Just pouring it. And no waiting it sit for 10 12 minutes, it really isn't. So, we'll get a wee sugar. I could have opened it, but I wanted, I wanted to be dramatic and open it a 58 pound bottle of whiskey, and it's now worth 180 pound. Try to be dramatic, very floral, slightly peated. White chocolate, fudge, wet grass, no, that kind of dampness, that, that wet, right, let's have a wee sip, see what we've got. You can feel the spirit and the taste. It's 
water. What a beautiful mouth feel. A thick mouth feel. It's like a kind of sawdusty mouth feel. It's no thin. It's very, very thick. And I like that. You get that in all spring bites. You get that thickness. Very quick arrival. It's there right away. And then it just dulls down. And as it dulls down, it lasts again and it's coming back. And you get a lovely flavour, a lovely coating in the mouth. The whole mouth's coated. It's absolutely lovely. Oh, I could drink that easy. I could probably get away with that without water. But let's put a little bit of water in it and see what it does to you. It's a little bit too much, but it's 59 point, it's 55. I keep saying 59, 55. Maybe you should go. Don't get your scotch mist yet. Now, that really opens it up. Really. Beautiful flavours. It's coming out at you. Chocolate's stronger. Sea breeze is there. The wet grass is there, slightly briny, everything it should be, everything it should be. It's nice on the palate, with water, for me anyway. It just takes a little bit of heat out of it, it just takes it down, and for me that's just perfect. Uh, probably a teaspoonful of water in that, no more. So that's spring bank 12. Oh, that's lovely. I'm going to pour another one in and leave it. And leave it for half an hour. And it'll be nicer. So that's me. All my spring banks opened. Still got one in the cupboard. I've got a few long rows to open. I've got an awful lot of open bottles at the moment. And, and again, uh, hopefully, I've got a couple. Of, I've I've got my name down for a local barley. Hope to get one, and I will open it, and I will get a wee taste at Glasgow Whiskey Festival. And it's absolutely beautiful. So, if you like Gab's drums, please, please subscribe. I need people to subscribe to get up. Comment on it. Tell me what you think of Springbank Twelve. Tell me what you think of people buying and opening them. You know, uh, people are entitled to do what they want when they buy a bottle of whiskey. But is it fair? Is it fair that these people are buying them and making that kind of money? If Springbank put the price of this up and started charging 100 and £120, we would go mad. We'd say, oh, you're robbing us, you're robbing us. It's no right, that money for a 10-year-old whiskey. Yet yeah, people seem to be prepared to pay 180 for a 10 year old whiskey. Makes me angry. Anyway, whiskey's for sharing, whiskey's for joying, it's for drinking, not selling. Be careful, thank you very much. Slange. Oh, there's honey in there, anyway. That's absolutely gorgeous. Beautiful.